First, the site is excavated and rebar is placed according to local code. Then the footing is poured and a capillary brake is placed on top of the footing to prevent capillary wicking from the ground. Then the foundation wall is poured, with anchor bolts placed according to local code. Drain tile is placed around both the interior and exterior perimeter of the footing. Waterproofing is applied to the exterior of the basement wall. Then a 4 inch layer of gravel is placed to facilitate drainage underneath the slab and to act as a capillary break. It also allows the removal of radon from beneath the slab if radon is present. Gravel wrapped in filter fabric is also placed around the exterior drainage tile to allow for drainage at the bottom of the basement wall. A layer of extruded polystyrene insulation is placed over the drainage rock, followed by a 6 mil polyethylene vapor retarder. Note that the vapor retarder is carried up the wall to where the top of the slab edge will be. Lengths of extruded polystyrene are placed against the wall to act as the isolation material and to provide a thermal break for the slab, which is poured next. A layer of sill seal is placed at the top of the foundation wall, and the first floor structure and decking is placed. Please note that all exterior seams should be sealed. The exterior trench is backfilled with granular material to allow for drainage along the foundation wall. The wood stud walls are built. In the basement, polyurethane spray foam is applied in an even layer from the isolation joint up the wall and along the rim joist. Inside of the spray foam, a stud wall is built to hold the interior finish, which serves as a thermal barrier. On the outside wall, a bead of sealant is used to seal the bottom of the weather barrier to the foundation. Two inches of extruded polystyrene is placed over the weather barrier. A channel is mounted at the bottom of the insulation layer to protect it from pests and weather. Furring strips are attached through the exterior insulation back to the wall studs. These provide a ventilation cavity for the exterior siding. Lastly, the exterior siding is applied to the furring strips. Music